Hi, and Happy New Year. This is Dr. Tansen. Uh, a lot of you probably know me best by my book, Teeming, How Superorganisms Work to Build Infinite Wealth in a Finite World. But a lot of you may not know that I have a wide range of endeavors that I do. So 2020 was pretty extreme. And, uh, seems like 2021 is off to a similar start. Uh, as we speak, we've got uh, people um, armed insurrection, I think, in the capital, so that's exciting. What we know is that when we design from that mechanistic efficiency mindset, uh, eventually what you get is the state that we're in, where you've got polarization, you've got uh, basically wage slaves rioting. <laughs> that isn't the way that um, nature designs. So my personal mission is to really catalyze this evolution revolution, as I call it. So the switch from machine mind, this mechanistic efficiency mind, to uh, living systems thinking. The first uh, and most important leverage point to me is a paradigm shift. So to that end, I've got, uh, I work with Geoversity um, in Panama. Uh, I'm the Dean of Biocultural Leadership there, and we're working to um, develop the leadership of tomorrow that can uh, engage in biocultural renewal in, a, in an intentional way. BUILD, Borrego Institute for Living Design, um, which we're launching now in the uh, Anza Borrego Desert near San Diego, that is a Geoversity uh, project. Borrego Institute for Living Design and Geoversity both are aimed at that paradigm shift. The second leverage point that I see is echoed in all the UN materials uh, in the classic work by Paul Ehrlich, Education of Women and Girls, an Opportunity uh, and Equal Representation of Women and Girls is a, a top leverage point, if not the number one leverage point on climate change. Um, and a lot of the problems that we're facing in the world today. And that's really an issue of collective intelligence. Human superorganisms, any superorganism, they gain their abilities uh, c collectively through that collective intelligence, through sharing um, and communicating and having a purpose um, and a set of simple rules. So in support of collective intelligence and specifically um, including women and girls' voices, um, I've got the Bonobo Revolution with the uh, floppy tip Flo and her badass biker gang of Bonobo babes. Um, yeah, we have a t-shirt. You're going to want one of them. Um, there, That's just terrific. We do podcasts. We do interviews with incredible women and uh, women's allies. It's a great initiative uh, and a lot of fun. The third one, of course, is organizations, the big dominoes. So to my mind, if you can, um, if we can cultivate that evolution revolution, in these organizations, those are big dominoes um, that can then support each other. And that's how we get flip on the system. And you'll be really excited to hear that. I have a new book coming out, um, The Teeming Transformation, which is much more applied than teeming. Teeming's a bit philosophical. Uh, this one's gonna be straight to the chase for busy executives. How do you team? How do you align your business with evolutionary thinking um, and evolutionary processes so that you can enhance diversity, enhance its uh, um, expression and inclusion in service of co-evolutionary cohesion that allows more possibilities and more innovation. So thank you for letting me share with you these uh, my three endeavors. We've got Team, Bonoa Revolution, and the Borrego Institute for Living Design with Geoversity. Uh, I hope you'll come into my ecosystem. Probably you've come in through Teaming, most likely, but I, I welcome you um, into our larger ecosystem with the Bonobo Revolution, with uh, the Borrego Institute for Living Design. It's going to be a real creative endeavor with science, art, and mythic story. It's going to be very exciting about uh, biocultural renewal. So how does biocultural renewal actually occur? And how do we um, cultivate biocultural leaders that can make those changes in the future? Happy New Year. Be well. Enjoy your time with your loved ones. Uh, hold them safe. And um, let's get together in the new year with um, some wildflowers, some beautiful um, places. Come join me in the desert and um, let's uh, come explore my ecosystem. I look forward to seeing you. Thank you.